Hi Pisces, welcome to your annual forecast for 2019. I'm so sorry for the delay. Okay? I know that a lot of you have been waiting for this forecast for such a long period of time. And I am really sorry for that. Anyway, here it goes. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Even though we're almost half around uh, the month of January, okay? Oh. Okay, let's take a look. Looks like finally Pisces, you'll be making a decision about this air sign. Okay. There is a truth that will be coming out and you will be very happy right in the middle of the month. Uh, you will also be moving away or walking away from a very cold, icy, cold, uh, sorry, cut off and dry and well-reserved fire sign man. Who's been giving you a lot of hard time. Okay, you feel you will feel a little bit wasted and depressed and frustrated, and then you will also be thinking about somebody from the past or somebody who lives far from you. Plus, money and finance sorry, your money or your finances will be growing. There is a new job offer, a business venture contract that will be signed finally, and I feel like there will be some. You know, some things that will be taking place abundantly. We'll go into the details of that later on. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go into you. Let's check out your sex life. It seems like in the month of January, there will be some headaches and there will be some nuisances that you'll have to go through. But as the month proceeds, you know, there will be some progress. And if you're also planning to invest in property, real estate, or if there is something that you want to buy or apply for a mortgage, then definitely the last week of the month will be very, very good for you. Or if you're also thinking of moving, okay? Hmm, it looks like someone will try to blackmail you. Or someone will be um, getting you down into a... Blackmail situation or emotional blackmail. Someone will also be very dominant over you or someone who just want to call the shots but doesn't want to commit. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that. Uh, 
All right, now this month of January for you, let's pull out more clarifications for that, okay? Because the last week of the month for you is way, way better than the previous, uh, sorry, for the first three weeks of this month, okay? So there will be some agonies, there will be some contracts, legal stuff that you will feel so relieved and it will be on your side, it will be in your favor. There's this truth that you will also be learning about the situation about a particular air sign person that you're currently dealing with a fire sign person that is older than you that you will be cutting off because of their inconsistencies in their dealing in their relationship communications and how they are treating you okay so you will just cut the crap off and you know like ah you know like i really don't want to deal with you anymore so you'll be fully moving on and you just want to find a better option better perspective and a healthy person to be in contact with okay now uh during the third week there is something that you will be losing which are three things okay and that three things even though you will be losing whether it's a big sorry big or small thing it will be replaced by a very very good luck and this is the start of your well new beginnings new chapters abundance as well and prosperity Good news at work. If you're opting for a promotion, then definitely you will be getting the recommendation that you needed and the, uh, you know, the backup from the higher management. And the money that you're expecting, it is definitely coming this way. Okay, sorry, this month or this week. Okay. And there is also like a huge amount of money that you are expecting, waiting, or that you, or that will be given to you in a form of letter, in a form of check by mail. All right. Somebody from the past, a witch is a fire or earth sign that you're in friends with or that you're very close to, will be coming back into your life as well during at this point. Now, when it comes to your work, you will be doing the magic. You will be doing everything that you can to prove that you're really, you know, the right candidate for the position, and then you will be holding on to your faith. There will be some issues, you know, gossips, nuisances that you will be like uh, cracking your mind, you're cracking your brain and you will also experience some headaches, body pain and migraines, but then you will be okay. You will learn how to deal with the situation. You only need to declutter. You have to remove all the things that you no longer need, including the people, situation, problems and, you know, belongings. Okay. Last week of this month, if you are thinking of buying a house, buying a vehicle as well, or if you are thinking of investing into a property, this is the perfect timing for that. And you will eventually land into a very good deal with a very good price. Okay? And you will be indulging. You'll be celebrating. Um, you know, when I say indulging, it's not just all about the vices. Okay? It could be some other things like treating yourself, pampering yourself, and stuff like that, or stuffing yourself, you know. Now, when it comes to your love life, you need to do some balancing. If there is something that you just recently started, or if there is something that already started in the past, that it's not really working out right now in your favor, and you've been like going back and forth, back and forth, and you keep on, you know, you keep on, um, on and off, on and off, especially if there's been like very harsh um, or violent fights that's been happening in between. It's time for you to cut it off. This person will do nothing but to bring you down, you know, from the status that, you all, that you're already in right now. As for the uplifting, you are the only one who can uplift yourself, okay? There is also a travel that you will be making right in the middle of the month from 15th until the 25th of this month. In the last week of this month, there is a money or there is a huge amount that you will, that's kind of a little bit unexpected that will be coming to you and you'll be very, very happy. This is the start of a new beginning for you. Now, sex-wise, there is someone who will be playing blackmail games with you. Okay, whoever this person is, don't fall for that because they only needed one thing from you and you obviously know what it is. So whatever happens and next time, please be careful. Okay, whoever you're going to be doing things with and you need to be a little bit more conscious. Okay, always secure yourself and always secure your own self-interest. Now, someone will also be 
playing dominant or very domineering over you. Even though you're going to be enjoying your physical contact, or even though you're going to be enjoying your, you know, your intimacy, still there is a, it will come to a point where you feel like, why am I being dominated even though we're no longer in bed? Okay, this person will be crossing the line and you just need to put them where they should be standing. Okay, um, as soon as possible. Don't wait for things to, you know, get worse. Health, be very careful with the kidney in your stones or gallbladder and high blood pressure, heartburn, um, chest pain. Well, I feel like it's more of depression that will be causing your, you know, your chest pain as well. Immune system, stop smoking. Um, you will also be experiencing... Um, excessive thirst or it's like your lips will be cracking your tongue will be white because I feel like that's um, it's related to an underlying health problem but it's much better for you to go and talk to your doctor okay you will also notice some you know some darkening of your fingernails or moon and you will also start noticing some some extra dryness in your skin Okay, and it will be very itchy. So it's much better for you to go and check out with your doctor or whatever it is. You will also have some problems sleeping or you will be oversleeping. Gaining weight, that's part of it. And you'll be very concerned and conscious about how you look like on the outside. Women, you need to be very careful with your abdomin um, abdominal problems or... Some women will be going through some duodenal cancer. Sorry, I'm sorry, not cancer. Uh, uh, duodenal uh, problems, okay, or ulcer. And I don't know why I mentioned that. I'm so sorry. And uh, some ovarian problems. Breast, you need to check with your doctor. And chest pain or heaviness in your chest or shortness of breath, okay. Aside from that, you need to avoid, oh, well, if you're already in a place like this, but you need to avoid very smoky or polluted area. Okay, just wear a mask if, you, if it's really inevitable at this point. Let's take a look, singles, what's going to be coming your way. Single Pisces, finally you're going to be having a love life soon. Hmm. And possibly marriage or somebody who will be proposing to you. Even if there's nobody in the horizon right now, that person will be coming to you. And this is actually somebody from the past. It was a fire sign. Mm -hmm. Be very careful. Uh, okay. The life and the love that you've been expecting or wishing or desiring, finally it's coming true and finally it will be given to you okay but there are some things that you need to learn as a lesson and there are also some people that you need to um that you need to cut off okay especially if you know that they are not really doing well or they're not really giving you whatever you need or if they are just taking 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 and you just keep on giving 
okay and they're just pretty much occupying your space and they're just doing nothing but to incur more toxicity in your life it's time for you to cut them off now this person is going to be coming into your life who is more likely a fire sign but has more earth element in them this is the right one for you but they are just too proud and they are just going through something right now they are also going through a big transition and all you need right now is just to be there for them understand them try to respect their decision because definitely they're going to be needing you you just need to be in standby okay i am not saying that you need to stay still and pause your life just you know while while you're waiting for this person but you have to put in mind that with the um right attitude and with the right approach this person will definitely be yours okay because they are also going through some some trials and some endings of their you know their relationship as well which is they're stuck with someone who's very unhealthy and someone is like you know cuckoo so even though it's gonna be giving you a lot more hard times and a lot more hardships okay you need to be more careful with your decisions if you feel like this person is not really paying attention to you right now then just wait okay because uh you know how it is to be in a depressive state and you know how it is to be heartbroken okay we all get bitter sometimes especially if there is something painful that we are trying to get over with so that is the only thing that you need to understand finances it seems like by the end of the month or starting the month of february that is the moment that you've been waiting for for things to uplift improve and develop okay that there will be some advantages and disadvantages and if you i feel like you will be participating in a lot of exhibitions conferences or you will be mingling in a large crowd for the entire year representing yourself or representing your company all right so let's take a look and check out your february forecast finally Okay, now that, let's take a look at your month of February, okay? Hmm, your attitude will be a little bit flighty during this month. You know, you need to uh, take a few steps back if there is something that you need to make a decision and you're still confused, okay, or you're waiting for some signs. Um, someone will also be playing tricks on you who's, an, or who's a younger earth sign and you just need to ride along with it, okay, but don't give out any money or don't give out any you know anything that they can be beneficial of well or, or that they can make benefits from and mm, this person is a little bit nasty so just be very careful with it work will be very busy and you're gonna be on the run there are times that you feel like you don't really have a team or you're not really working with anyone at this point but then you know there's also a time where you feel like you're blessed you're happy because someone is looking after you or someone will be helping you
Ooh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. A big betrayal by a by an air sign. Okay, especially for those Pisces who's actually with an air sign during this time, you need to be very, very, very careful and very conscious of your surroundings because definitely this person is only waiting for the right moment to. Mm, do it or to do whatever it is that they are doing right behind you be very be very careful with this air sign oh by the way um chinese forecast is already available on my website okay the for the year of the pig i am not yet done with the um yearly forecast for all signs for the western um astrology Right, but Aries, Taurus, and uh, Gemini, it's all ready and it's there in my website already. All right, now this month of February for you, you need to watch your back, okay? You need to be very conscious of your surroundings, whether it's an ear sign or an earth sign, but you are very prone to betrayal, okay? In both your job and your personal life. Now, there is a decision that you have to make, but you're so confused whether you should take it or not, or whether you should do it or not. But it is much more advi advisable for you to take a few steps back because this is not really the right time for you to make a big decision, okay? You will be caught up in a lot of depression, a lot of frustrations, confusion as well. And you just need to do your, you know, your usual everyday routine and don't change anything at this point. It is not really advisable for you even. Your finances will be stable. You know, um, I feel like this is this will also be a very busy month for you. You will be traveling and you will be representing yourself or your company. Or there is a particular tr a business travel that you will be making, and this is the start of your big dreams. Okay, you will be a achieving. You will be um, reaching up to your dreams. You'll be reaching up the heights of your career. But then expect that there will be some people who will try to bring you down or who will try to you know to block your way or who will try to bring more chaos or in storm okay as you proceed to your to your life development or progress now be very careful with the younger earth sign in your love life be careful with an ear sign okay there is a huge deception and betrayal that is just waiting for for you to be discovered, for you to unfold, and for you to really see it right before your eyes, okay? Um, I feel like you will be, you will handle it well, but it will traumatize you for the next two to three weeks, at least until half of March, okay? Um, it's going to bother you, you know? with your work and I feel like you'll have a hard time concentrating on your chores and in your responsibilities and there will be some mistakes or you know some errors in your delivery and there will be some some of your works that will be more of a back job okay now you will be asked to formulate an idea or like um you know like a blueprint for the new project that you will be handling and you will be traveling with five more people, right, by the third week of this month. And this is for your job or this is for your promotion, okay? Your um, your finances in your profession, it will continuously go stable. And it will continuously go, um, you know, go well. 
Mm, I feel like you will also be practicing some of your old skills and you will be organizing some meetings. Okay, so this is what's going to be preoccupying you. Meanwhile, that there is somebody from the past who is an air sign or who is a water sign that will be giving you the tower moment or that will be giving you that awful moment. All right. Now, when it comes to your love life, while you're busy working and while you're busy making money, there is someone who's an ear sign. Definitely, it's a, it's a consistent ear sign. Okay, that is conniving with someone who's an earth sign, and you will find out about this. Um, I feel like this is somebody around their work, or somebody that they're working with, or somebody that they are working for. Either way, you're going to be discovering that there is something that's going on right behind you. While you're busy working, you're working your ass off, and your partner is also busy and working in something. Okay. If there has been some cold treatments, distances, they don't want to be touched, no sex, no intimacy, no hi, hello, how's your day? You know, no good morning, good night, bye. Nothing. No communications between the two of you. Then obviously that's already red signs, red flag signs, because they are already focusing on someone else. Okay. This relationship or this whole thing has been going on for three weeks or three months already. And you will soon discover because they will intensely change as, you know, who they were than who they are right now. And there will be some questions, confrontations, and then finally a revelation by the end of this month. And you will be very, very hurt. I mean, this is already something that you've been expecting, but this is not something that you really wanted to see, especially right at this point that you are on the verge of a delivery of your project or deadline, okay? So expect some disturbances and some delays or blockages. Now, sex life, you won't really have the zest, okay, to do it. Um, There are times that you would try to do it, but you can't, you know, for men, you won't, really get it up or for women you won't really have that zest you won't really feel um you won't really feel good or in the mood or you know aroused or something like that and you will be doing some ways or some things for you to really you know get back on track or get in the mood but unfortunately it's not really working so this is going to be a very difficult month for you when it comes to your love life now, when it comes to your sex, sorry, when it comes to your health, um, some questions about your immune system, bronchial problems, difficulty in breathing, and I feel like you will be, hmm, you will have frequent colds, flu, ear infection, nasal infection, or. Yeah, some eye infection as well. And there's also like a like a health problem or illness that will be coming back to you. Uh, an illness where you used to have when you were a little when you were a little child. Okay. You need to have some green vegetable diet, lower in legumes. And you will be very conscious of your skin. You will have some acne that you will be noticing. Some bumps, red bumps, red dots, rashes. Very, that's very itchy and scaly and thick. Um, I feel like it's due to a, to a side effect of the medicine that you're going to be taking or to a cream that you are applying. Immune system needs to continuously be boosted. And don't stay too late at night or don't... Uh, because it's your eyes that's going to be a problem. Fish diet or seafood diet is a must. And I feel like might as well go organic for this month, okay? Instead of uh, taking white rice. Now, you will also have some problems with your knees, with your left knee. Or you will have some problems standing up, okay? Plus, I feel like it's related to your kidney. And aside from that, you are also prone to appendicitis. So be very careful, okay? Now let's take a look, singles. What's going to be coming your way this month of February? Mm, 
the devil. Oh my gosh. These shorts. Mm -hmm. The moon. Uh -uh -uh. Wow, this is not really a very <laughs> favorable month for you. It is a betrayal from an ear sign that will be in your heartbreak or your, you know, your, um, your heartbreak or your heartache will be mended by, this is more likely like a friend thing or like a, like a person that you've known for, for a long, long while, okay? Uh... You know, be very, very careful because this month, you know, especially for those Pisces women who's been um, conniving with someone, okay, or if you're the third wheel, there is going to be a big revelation that's going to be coming to you. And I feel like there will also be a confrontation, you know, with a person that you're so afraid to meet and face and standing there right in front of you. Okay, so be very, very careful. This is not going to be a very favorable month for you. Uh, and uh, someone whom you're friends with or someone that you've known for a long, long while and that you consider as your soulmate will be helping you get out of this sticky situation or will be helping you to get out of this messy situation. You have to travel or move away for a little while for this to be, you know, for this to be cut off for a little while and then... An air sign woman that will be confronting you, someone who is very much established with a status quo and uh, has a lot of money, okay? Be very, very careful. And for men, if you're dating multiple relationships or multiple people at the same time, then there will be a revelation and there will be a smackdown, okay? So be very careful about that. Finances is still sure and finances will, will remain stable. It's just that your love life will be in a long hole and long tornado. Let's take a look at your month of March. Feeling a little bit lonely and sad while everyone is celebrating around your work. Seems like there is a party or there is a celebration that all of you will be gathering. You won't be able to concentrate in your work. Some of you will be quitting your job or some of you will be suspended. Okay, I don't feel like you will be um, fired, but it seems like you need like some sort of a day off or holidays or like a quick vacation all right it is because of your love life
some Pisces who's all, who's um, with a water sign will have more stability during this time, but then there will be a sad. No, there will be. Oh my God, this. Hmm. You're gonna be very busy working, but then your love life is something that's gonna be like really tumultuous during this year. Better stay clear of it. Make sure that you're going to be protecting your business or make sure that you are going to be safe. You know, this month, what started with a lie will also end up with a lie, okay? There's something that you're just waiting for to be revealed, to be said, to be discovered, and to be laid down at the table. But then, you know, that thing that you're asking for will finally be coming to you. And I feel like when it comes to you, you're not going to be ready, okay? Um, somebody from the past will also be getting in touch with you, but then you will somehow feel like, nope, I'm not really in the mood to get in touch with anybody or I don't want to talk to anyone at this point. You will take care of yourself and you will be like hiding from the, you know, from your friends, family members, and the, even into to your workplace. You'll be calling in sick or you're going to be like staying at home for three days. Okay. A fire sign that will be calling you or that will be reaching out to you, but then you will be putting your balls up. Meanwhile, when it comes to your work, while everyone is celebrating and while everyone is very happy, they're celebrating, there's something that's going to be coming up. The, the company will be announcing a very big news that everyone will be happy and delighted about. And you are the only one who's just like sulking and very depressed and not really excited with the news. However, with the promotion or with the position that you've been like trying to get, it will definitely be coming to you during at this point. And you will be there will be some seniors or there will be some old colleagues or uh, senior executives that will be um, coming to you and that will be talking to you and you will be getting a very sound advice on how to get through and separate your personal dilemma against your work uh, workloads or work responsibilities and your adventure and your chapter is about to begin and you will learn a lot more with the people that will be very concerned of your situation. Now, when it comes to your love life, you will be talking to this fire sign and you will be working on your foundation. You'll be working on your communications, what you don't want, what you want, and what, what are the things that you need to cut off. You'll be learning from a lot of things and you will also learn how to manage and handle your both of your finances. But there is a lie or there is a betrayal that will still be haunting you and that will still be you know biting you and this is something that you just need to be you know strong if you want to make this work then go through with it if you don't want to you know get this over and done with and forget about everything then move on okay but i feel like you will try and choose to stay because you really want to make this work even though it's just going to be very hard for you to forget and forgive, but eventually you're going to get there. Now, when it comes to your sex life, 
it, this is not really a very favorable month for you that even though your partner will be teasing you and will be asking you that they really want it you're the one who's going to be like turning them down and not really in the mood there will be some teasings here and there connecting and kissing and patting but then no real sex at all that's going to be happening as you will most likely be sulking and very depressed now when it comes to your health immune system your your lungs um ulcer problems and problems with your gums or your teeth you will have some sleep apnea because of your depression and because of your um well your blood isn't really circulating properly be very careful with someone who is infected with h virus um be very careful about that and uh, be conscious of what you eat you will also be very um you will have some problems with your eyesight or sensitive to to light or you will have some problems driving at night you also need to be a little bit more hygienic with whatever you eat and wash it thoroughly and carefully there are some lifestyle or food lifestyle that you need to turn your back on and you need to repair your clothes because either you're losing weight or you are gaining weight but i feel like most of the pisces are losing weight that's the reason let's take a look at your singles well forecast for the singles let's take a look Well, it seems like someone hears your prayers and it, there will be some ceasefire of the, you know, the things that you're going through right now, the war and the bantering and bickering with other people. You will soon be mended and you will soon be healed by someone who's very close to you. And this is an earth sign. The fire sign that is kind of working its way through you. You just want to shut them out of your you know outside your door but then they will persist and they will persuade you which they will be winning in the end now don't shut down your doors just because that they are something that you're going through because you're not alone okay you're lucky because not all people have some people in their side during their tough times but then this time you you will always have the people help and advice and you know wisdom that you need to go through in a situation and you're very lucky and gifted for having that kind of people around you now there are a lot of balancing and the decision that you have to make during at this point and make sure that you will be making a decision when you already have a clear head and no longer emotional you will also be working on your communications and your healing good news coming when it comes to your finances and promotion something will be working in your favor and uh, the fire sign and the earth sign will be helping you out as well to uplift you and there will be let's say you know like uh, the ray of the sun that will be shining through right in the middle of the dark clouds and you're very lucky to have that okay let's take a look at your april forecast so you won't be grieving this month so don't worry Now, for the month of April, let's take a look what's going to be coming your way.
Mmm. More worries. Mmm. Seems like you're really going to be dealing with this, uh, air, sorry, fire sign from the past. And, and you're going to be learning the truth. Seems like this person is not yet disentangled or not yet separated from the other person that they used to be with. So you're going to be dealing with the jealousy, okay? Oh, drama, drama, drama. Alright, now, it seems like you'll be dealing with a betrayal, okay? The person that you're currently seeing with right now, or the one that you're with right now, for those who's already married, you will learn that they are still continuously having an affair or continuously seeing somebody right behind you, and this is someone older than you. Now, for those who's not yet married, then the person that you're currently seeing with right now is either they have reconciled with somebody from the past without you knowing or they are still communicating with somebody that they cannot just cut off from their life okay middle of the month you will be dealing with a lot of problems dramas you know um uh well lies and deceptions and um confrontations confrontations that will always lead to a violent fight or physical fight and i don't see any legal for now but it seems like there will be some shift and big change that's really going to happen and come okay now when it comes to your work you will have a hard time concentrating on the things that you need to do deliver and hand over and with that right in the middle of the meeting you are not going to be you know concentrating much or you're not going to be mentally present which is your colleagues and your bosses will notice and they will be giving you a warning okay you need to focus and put your back on put sorry you need to put your head back on track and back on your priorities and your you know your targets and achievements and if you're not going to be a little bit alert okay or watch your move or your decision then definitely there is a possibility of you being sacked during this month be very careful now, when it comes to your, okay, love life, you thought that this fire sign is the one that you really want to marry, okay? You thought that this one is the one who can really make you happy, someone who's going to be, like, you know, driving off to your knees and um, give you the life that you wanted, give you the world, or make you their world. Um, but the thing here is, there are a lot of complications that you expect that will come out from this situation or from this relationship that even though you have tried to give this person a chance, there are 
too many things that's happening at once and there are too many revelations that's been unfolding right before you and because of this it's you will start to figure out that the air sign who betrayed you in the past has something to do with a lot of this why all of this are coming all of a sudden now when it comes to your sex life it seems like you will try to fix whatever that's needed to be fixed physically and intimately you will try to do your best but then it's like it's going to be a one-way thing you are the only one who will be pleasuring your partner and your partner couldn't even pleasure you or won't even exert an effort to pleasure you be also be very careful to be exposed by someone who is intentionally sneaking or he will intentionally expose you okay with your let's say the very confidential and compromising moments now when it comes to your health there is a um food lifestyle that you need to turn your back on you also need to be a little bit more careful in eating fruits or taking too much sugar okay in your diet um gaining weight but your feet will be swollen your veins will also be swollen and you will notice that there's numbness in your right part of your body right arm right leg and right face and be very careful if you have some stroke history in your family um go organic ah, i don't actually heard if you're gonna go organic for rice coffee and uh, some of the food stuff also be very careful with your pets or be very careful with you know uh with some wild animals because not all animals are have their not all sorry not all pets will be in their good moods or not all pets will be in their you know calm season this time if you have a pet inside your home they will be a little bit irritable and they're going to be a little bit too hard to handle or uncontrollable okay um as much as possible move your kids away from them for now because their moods are going to be a little bit unstable again some new some new blemishes and allergies and some dermatological problems will still be arising and will still be coming out you will also have some problems with your nasal blockages or nasal polyp and you will always have a problem with your acid reflux okay and problems with your throat now Hmm. Now, you need to be a little bit more careful in eating raw food or vegetables that's, that's going to come right from the supermarket. And aside from that, be very careful in climbing up the stairs or uh, going to a high places or higher planes. Because definitely there is an injury that's going to happen to you and because you're not going to be in yourself much. Be careful of falling as well. Let's take a look, singles. What's going to be coming your way this month of April? Oh, wow. You're still going to be brokenhearted over a betrayal that's going to be happening. Changes are coming in your way, but there are some things that you also need to make a decision. Okay, sharp decision or a very important decision about your relationship. Sorry, about your previous relationship or past relationship, especially if you're still messing around with an ex. Or with someone who is more of a friends with benefits okay you need to heal yourself and this is going to be the main blockage for you or the main delay for you to achieve your goals you have to put in mind that you are trying to win the um 
you know, the uh, the approval of your managers or the approval of your superiors. And if you're going to be slacking off or if you're going to be like not prioritizing your goals, then it will go down to another person. OK. Um, you know, the good thing about here is you will know that the person is not really deserving or they don't really deserve your, you know, your kind of affection and your attention. And despite of what you have given and what you have offered and they just tossed it around and they just, you know, disregard it, it's time for you to walk away and move away. No need to deal like, what am I going to do? Should I this? Should I that? You know, you know what should what you should do when there is a betrayal or when there is someone who's been deceiving you. And I feel like there will be some changes that you will kind of a little bit baffle, okay? And even though there is a small opportunity that's going to be in scale, you will try to work your way around that, okay? There will be small communications here and there, and I feel like this person that you will be like cutting off from your life, they will still try and convince you of their lies. But you know what? It's just really time to give it up. Okay, as there's too much complications and you need to follow your gut instinct. Okay, your work during at this time will be in peril. Okay, be very careful. Let's take a look at your month of May. Still be very careful in climbing up to high places. Okay, and be careful in traveling on a plane. All right, now let's take a look for the month of May, okay? Mm -hmm. Month of May. Oh, wow. Well, hmm. well, middle of this month, you're going to be going through a transformation, a communication with a fire sign that will be breaking your heart. It seems like your communications during this month will not be very good. So be very careful of the things that you're going to be saying, okay? And there will also be some house changes or there will be some things that will be changing in your house or you're going to be going for a renovation or um, you're going to be moving to a new place, new house. And uh, it seems like there are some things in the house or place or, you know, something that is related to your property that will be changing or that you're going to be resenting doing it for someone. Okay, now let's take a look at your love life. Mm. Feeling a little bit sad about this ear sign. Being cut off and dry, thinking about the past. But still, this person is the one who really means a lot to you. Okay, finally for your sex life.
Be careful in getting a sprain. Third week of this month. Okay, of this uh, month of May. Okay, let's take a look. You feel so stuck in a situation that you just want to move away or go away. There is a decision that you have to make that's been hanging or looming above your head, but you're just trying to find an excuse not to make it. Okay, you're still trying to see if there's still a chance for the situation to be fixed or for the situation to be helped or to progress, to develop, or somehow if you're going to be, if you're going to try to be a little bit more patient or maybe if you can just try a different approach, maybe that it will be changing. But with all of those delays and daily dallying, it seems like you are the one who's been delaying your life and your mind. Well, there are some things that you really have to, you know, that you really have to um, finalize as you're already weather, weathering the storm alone. You're, you've been putting up these walls up and you've been trying to protect yourself, but still, it still ends up in the same way or same spot. Now, there will be a big transition that's going to be coming your way right in the middle of the month, and you'll be very surprised with how strong you're going to come out of this, okay? And... There will be some communications and there will be some disagreements or agreements or there will be some talks and discussions that the two of you will be sitting down together but will just end up in a fight or it will just end up in a breakup. Now someone will be moving in and out of your place or someone will be relocating or you will have a renovation that's going to be happening in your life, in your house. Either way there will be some changes and this is because that you know there will be some um tension and friction that will be breaking down when it comes to your work you will be under a lot of pressure and you're not going to be focusing too much you're trying to be strong but you're going to be busy like uh you know like distracting yourself or you will be feeling a little bit distracted it's why most of your works you will just deliver it or hand it over without even reviewing it and it, you know your boss will just keep on sending it back to you review this do this redo that change this remove that okay so it's like you're gonna be a little bit irritated during the first and second week of this month and then down to the third you will realize that what you're doing to your work is a purely sabotage thing okay so you will be going you will be getting back on track and you will be rechecking your work again and you know it's like you're going to be focusing on yourself and in your work again so oh well with the help of some seniors in your you know in your workplace that they are going to be noticing what's really going on with you that you're starting to act a little bit preoccupied and uh, not really in yourself okay so some people will be snapping or some people will be like waking you up or some people will just be reminding you okay and uh now when it comes to your love life this air sign that's been making you feel so isolated lonely and you know not so appreciated there are a lot of things that you want to start all over again it seems like you know there is also a love triangle between you and the fire sign you are the one who has the air sign and there is you know it's like you are caught in between the fire and the water sorry the fire and the air okay now it's time for you to make a choice that the reason that there will be some friction and tension in your relationship is because there are some things that you need to make a decision about which the fire sign will be aware of but you don't want to make a decision okay and i feel like this is the decision that you have to make during this month now you will be traveling and you want to avoid making the decision there are some things that you need to cut off people situation or relationship or situation but all you all you know right now is that you are happy to both of them and you both need them but you know you cannot really have the best of both worlds so you really have to make a choice and even though you both love this person or this people it's time for you to make a choice and choose only one of them when it comes to your sex life you're feeling a little bit excited and feeling the zest of hiding, okay? The other one is giving you whatever it is that you want. The other one is giving you stability, the confidence and familiarity. But you are looking for more thrill, excitement, and, you know, steam in your sex life. You will be feeling a little bit bored with the fire sign, but you'll be feeling a little bit more excited with the air sign. So, it's up to you. Now, when it comes to your health... Dermatological problems, skin problems, sebum, you know, um, thing. And I feel like you're going to have some bumps that is related to your sebum. 
and chest pain, stomach problems, digestive problems, you're going to be overeating or you're going to be binging too much or there will be some because of your depression. You also need to rehydrate yourself. You need to stop smoking because your lungs, your throat, your teeth, and your breath will be very much affected. You will also have some nasal problems or nasal infection. You need to be careful with your left knee as it's um, more likely that you know your bones are getting brittle or there is there is a like a like an operation that you have gone through in the past and now it's going to start becoming more painful again and fever cold flu sneezing you know it's also going to be happening to you and your immune system you need to strengthen your immune system it's time for you to ask your doctor for some more vitamins to fight this and heartburn um high blood pressure low blood pressure and back pain more back pain now let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way this month of may Okay, that fell down. The Ten of Swords. Betrayal. Single Pisces, be very careful this month. Whoops. <laughs> Eight of Cups. Okay, another shuffle. Eight of Swords. You are moving away to a situation, person, relationship, or environment where there are too many betrayals, okay? Someone will also be betraying you. And for those who are still trying to work things out or communicating with their ex, it's time for you to open up your eyes. Okay, now... You'll be feeling a little bit caught up and dry this month. And uh, I don't feel like you're going to be in touch with your water element. Okay, but instead you're going to be more in touch with your air element. Um, I feel like there will be some communications that you don't really want to land on. Or you will be a little bit argumentative or irritative, or sorry, um, irritable during this month. You will also be having some arguments or some tension with your boss and someone who will be intentionally making fun of you or will be bullying you at work. Um, there is a younger uh, earth sign that will be lying to you and that you will be catching them and an air sign or a fire sign. Okay. Now, I feel like you need to be a little bit more careful and, you know, you're also going to be a little bit sharp-tongued this month. Be very careful with the things that you're going to say, that you're going to do impulsively, 
are the decisions that you have that you will be making while you're in the virtue of your emotions because there is a possibility that you would just storm me that you would just be storming out of your office and say that you know you quit this is not really the right time try to be a little bit more try to be a little bit more patient now you will hear about some bad news okay or some very unpleasant news about a person that you're still holding on at the, or that you're still holding back okay and i feel like because of this it's already costing you your you know it's already costing you your your uh what do you call this your real work and your business okay Although I don't really feel like this whole situation will be, you know, long lasting. You will just have to go through some lessons to learn and some eye opening situations. But this month, you better be careful with your temper flying off. Okay. If there is someone that you're still holding on to, this person have already moved on, but they are not telling you that they've already moved on. But you will be learning the big truth and the big revelation this month okay which is an air sign let's take a look at your month of june another transition but down to the last two weeks of the month it seems like it's gonna be very good Right. Mm. Looking good. Down by the end of the month. And it seems like you will be working on winning someone back. Okay, somebody from the past. Well, you just need to, as I've said, you know, the month of May. The reason why there are some things that will be occurring is that it is to open up your eyes and to give you a lesson to learn, which is, I feel like you are really going to be learning your lesson because now this month of June, you will be working on your relationship and you will be working on your attitude, how you deal with your, you know,
Okay, now... Mm. You, okay, this is more likely the aftermath of the month of May. That you will somehow feel so stuck and uh, you don't want to move on as much as you want to move on. You feel a little bit more confused. You will try to, you know, to reach out to someone. There will be some communications here and there. But then you will also realize that, you know, like, what am I doing? You know, so there will be a reflection that you're going to be doing down the second week of the month. A transition that will be you know, that will be happening, you will also be changing, you'll be growing, matured, you will be improving your communications because you tend to bottle up your feelings. You tend to just keep it to yourself and not really say it to the person or not say it with your partner. But during this month, you will know how to bridge communications. You will know how to relay your feelings. And you will be reaching out more. Now, you will be working out on reaching out to this person from the past. You will be changing your attitudes and behaviors and how you approach problems in a relationship, the adjustment phase. Because, you know, I feel like the reason why this is happening is because you took the easy way out or you are, you know, let's say, for example, that you moved in right away without even getting to know each other. So there will be some things that, you know, that you need to adjust first and, you know, accept to yourselves and you're going through those adjustment period. Okay. But now anyway, you will be improving more of your communications because I feel like you really love this person. You really have this heart and affection that even though there will be some distractions, there will be some temptations or there will be some things that you feel like you can have on the other side you will be staying sorry you will be deciding to stay with this person so you know what's going to happen is more likely life's default choice sorry life's default choice for you okay this is not your choice but it is life's default choice okay now Um, when it comes to your work, you'll be daydreaming a little bit, and I feel like you will be attending a celebration. Now, there are actually two things that could happen, okay, or that could possibly take place. One is that you will feel a little bit unfair or the, or you feel like the management is not really being fair to you. Well, consider this as more of a punishment for being, you know, uh, negligent for the past month. But you, you know, right in the middle of the month, you will be like finishing all your tasks and responsibilities and your deadlines. And you will be reflecting upon like where my life is really going. You know, I feel so depressed that I feel like this is not really what I just want to do. That I'm not happy that being in this, you know, like having a stable job. Yes, I can, you know, I can travel. I can live with this. I can, you know, pay my debts and stuff like that. But I want something more. I want to have more meaning. I want to have more like, a, you know, like a, some other, um, what do you call this? The purpose, okay? So this is the time where you will be going through your old stuff, old diaries, old um, pictures, and, you know, going through the list of your old friends as well, and you'll be getting in touch with them. And you, I feel like you'll be volunteer, you will uh, volunteer for a cause, okay, or for some, so you will be, um, it's like there is an orphanage that you, or foundation that you want to visit right by the end of the month, okay? Now, love life, there will be a change of situation or there will be, you know, a, like a, a turnaround, a 360 degree turn. And with the storm that you're going to be coming out from, it will make you a better person, a braver, a brighter and smarter person. And you'll be working on your attitudes. You will learn how to forgive. You will learn how to be humble. You're the one who's going to be uh, like reaching out and uh, bridging the communication to this other person. Which is you're both financially stable, okay? There's no question about if someone will be taking advantage of you or not. But this person that has a lot more earth element in them, despite of them being a fire sign, you will choose to go back with them, okay? 
your sex life this month will be very hot and and steamy and i feel like you're gonna be stepping out of your standards okay you will also try and learn more new things and more new styles and adventure and you will have a different fetish during this month with your partner now health wise um you will have some problems with too much you know um nose blockage or you will have some bad colds during this month and uh, you will be a little bit feverish um make sure that you will be um asking your doctor for um the big h and i feel like you will also have some problems with your uh with your face with your skin problems with your acne or there are some red bumps that will just you know appear out of nowhere in different odd places okay and still you will have some problems with your migraine you will have some pain from top to toe okay especially migraines um nasal problems toothache um chest pain ulcer and bone problems okay especially your kneecap um you will also be binging food binging and you'll be into sweet stuff now there are some medicines or you'll be opting for some lose weight thing but you know what it is much better for you to lose weight the natural way okay because there will be some consequences and you will also have some problems sleeping or oversleeping during this month let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way this month of june You know, I still have to edit the uh, video testimonial of my client right after my coaching, but uh, maybe right after all the videos, I'll be re-uploading that. Sorry, I'll be uploading that. Okay. Being more in tune with your job and with your career, you know what you want. I also feel like you're thinking of some small opportunities to increase your revenue or your salary. There are some things that you need to work upon. But, but you know, one thing's for sure is that you are no longer contented with whatever it is that you're getting right now. You want to increase. You want more development more progress more challenge more of a different task okay and i feel like there is something that you're going to be making as a, as a role well no actually it's a more of a major change for yourself some pisces will be resigning from their job or will be quitting their job and they want to start a small business or they're or while they are you know working they want to start a small business on the side that while they are trying to stable this or right sorry while they're trying to establish this then they're going to be working okay because if you feel like you want to you just don't want to work your entire life um despite of you being financially stable you want to have more meaning to your existence now when it comes to your love life an older fire sign from the past will be approaching you and will be calling you or will be getting in touch with you now you need to use your god instinct whether this person can be trusted or is it worthy of your time again or your you know your feelings or is it worth investing your time and everything again okay because it, 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 there's no betrayal that occurred in the past but it's more likely that this person did not really take you seriously okay in the past but now you have to use your gut instinct if this person is um willing to commit okay let's take a look at your month of july okay let's take a look what's going to be coming your way this month of july Mm. 
It seems like emotionally you're going to be going through a lot of uh, transformations. Okay. Um. Oh. Some Pisces has already been with their, you know, with their uh, partners or with the some non Pisces um people or couples who's uh, already in a relationship but not yet married. You are gonna get married this month, or the, it's more of a surprise wedding, okay, or like a like an engagement that uh, you did not or you don't um expect it coming. Okay, there will also be a celebration at work, which is for those who hasn't got the promotion, then this is going to be another um, another uh, break for you, okay? And I feel like it's going to be another big opportunity for you to take advantage of. Finally, you're on the right track anyway. So I feel like you're really doing the right thing and you're in the right way or you're in the right track with the right person. Uh, this person that you're going to be with is really your soulmate plus more of a game changer. Even though you tried to resist it at first, you know, that you just want to stay the way you are. Or you just want to, you know, oh, your love life will be very good this month. Take a look at your sex life. You're going anal this month, and I feel like you're gonna be a little bit obsessive about you know trying that thing. For those who hasn't you know who has not really tried doing that, I feel like you're gonna be a little bit obsessed about doing that in some other dirty thing. Uh, you also need to stimulate your fantasies or your imagination or, you know, some stuff in your mind for you to feel a little bit more in or a little bit more into it for you to feel it. And finally, for your health. This month of July for you is a little bit better than May and June. Okay, now this month of July for you, it seems like you are really, you know, growing matured and being more clear as to where your life should go. You will be the authority of your own. You will learn how to cut off those old behaviors, old patterns and old, you know, attitudes that you know isn't really helping you out or that's just, you know, creating more toxicity in your life. And now you're more aware of what you really want and what you don't in your life, okay? The third week of this month is way, way better than the previous two months, which are June and May. And you will also be walking away from those unhealthy habits, people, situation, influences, resources, and some other things that you feel like you don't really need it, you know, on your way to success or on your way up, and it's just weighing you down. Plus, some Pisces are not yet married but has been in a relationship or has been single for a long period of time. You will be receiving or an engagement or a proposal or you are going to be getting a surprise marriage or getting married during this month or by the end of the month. 
Now, when it comes to your workplace, you'll be very happy and uh, fulfilled with your achievement. You will also be noticed by your company because of your ideas, presentations, you know, your zealousness or your zest in your career, in your profession, and, you know, becoming more and more successful. Plus, there is going to be another promotion or a position that will be opening up and you're going to be taking advantage of that. Even though there's a part of you that you feel like a little bit inadequate or not really happy with the situation, you will still try and push yourself to be a better person because you're you're going to be feeling more inspired and more into it okay you will be networking connecting with other people with your clients with your peers and you will be you know everyone will notice that you're slowly becoming a better person and more noticeable okay now when it comes to your love life as i've said that this person that you truly love and that you know uh that's been in your life now which is more likely a fire sign will be um making a big change or will be giving this person is more of a game changer okay and you already know this to yourself you know that this person is really the right one for you so you're going to be going for it you're going to be like changing for yourself not for this person there will also be some it's like you will be redecorating, renovating, or you're going to be changing your house or, uh, you know, your, uh, your residence. There will be more good news. You will be approved for a house loan or for a mortgage or a mortgage or something like that. And there is a contract or some bank transactions that you're going to be doing by the end of this month. You're going to get approved. Now, when it comes to your sex life, okay, as I've said, you will be having some different fetish, going anal, or you're going to be a little bit more obsessed about doing it right behind and do doing it or being a little bit more experimental when it comes to bed. Now, you need to reignite your imagination for you to, you know, improve it, and especially your performance, because you're going to have a hard time, uh, you know, getting it up, okay, for men. And you're going to be a little bit more distracted. It's not that you're you're not attracted to your partner anymore, but it's like it's like you are. Hmm. It seems like you're going to like doing this in a, you know, in an odd. Place. Let's say, for example, uh, you know, inside a basement or in a boiler room or, you know, in a coved area or inside a car in a parking in a forest or something like that. A different place will be reigniting your passion and you're going to know that you're also into this kind of stuff. So this is going to be a big part of your transformation. Now, when it comes to your health you will be gaining weight you need to work on your immune system you need to work on your blood pressure heart rate pulse rate and sleep apnea there is a you need to uh, stop drinking and you need to stop uh, sorry yeah eating and binging into junk food eye problems uh, getting infected with someone who's oh and also be careful with malaria and be careful in getting infected by a virus and you need to freshen up a little bit, okay? You will be detoxifying your yourself and your soul by traveling to a place near the water, and you need to strengthen your immune system. Let's take a look, singles, before we proceed to your month of August. You are going to be ending up with someone that you're really destined to be with. Okay. Hmm. 
Hmm, looks like you're going to be signing a new contract. If you are trying to go for a new job, there will be a new job offer and uh, you will be signing a contract with a new company, okay? Uh, I feel like you will be moving. Yeah, you feel like you'll be changing your job during this month. Some Pisces women will also find out that they are, you know, especially if you've been having sex, of course, obviously. Uh, you're going to find out that you're pregnant and, and you don't really want it. Now, you will be more focused on your job and uh, you're going to start not thinking too much about getting married or ending up in a relationship. Okay, there's somebody from the past that you're still thinking, but you don't want to think more about this. You want to concentrate on your new beginning, on your new career, and, and in your new profession. You want more growth, more meaning, more purpose, and you want to expand your knowledge and skills. Okay, you want to be proud, you want to make someone proud, and you want to make your family proud as well. <coughs> Even though you're going to have a lot of... Um, you know, second thinking or second thought about moving, but this transformation is going to be very good for you. So don't be so afraid of it. Let's take a look at your month of August. Breaking the rules <clears throat> for the last time.
Okay. Now, uh, for your general um, outlook for this month of August, it seems like this air sign is finally flying away. Okay, finally moving into a different path, and finally trying to find their own nest. Okay. Now, while you're gonna be busy trying to clean up your past and uh, dealing with this air sign person once and for all and for the last time, even though there are some things that you're afraid that it might just, you know, come out in the open, but you don't want this fear to hold you back anymore, okay? You will start to be more prepared, ready, and you will start to be more focused on the changes that you want to manifest in your life. You will also be traveling by the last week of this month and there is a very good news that will become your way. A new contract that will be approved, signed, or agreed upon or you will be getting the promotion, the job opportunity, or the increment that you're wishing for. Now, when it comes to your workplace, a huge transition, you know, it's like you're rising from the ashes and uh, you will also be helping out or mentoring other colleagues or younger colleagues that even though you want to spend more time with your loved one or with your family, you will be a little bit preoccupied and you'll be coming home late, okay? Uh, you will also be moving into a new um, desk, department, office, team this month, but just be very careful and make sure that you're going to be keeping all your files intact. Okay, or in check, you need to do some um, auditing and you also need to do some inventory. You'll be honing more of your skills and um, I feel like there are some things that you will be, um, you know, um, adding up or changing or improving, especially extending your office inside your place or inside your house. And even though while you are resting or even though while you're trying to go on your um your own personal time, you're still going to be thinking about more projects and more improvements when it comes to your job. So you are going to be growing more matured and more responsible during this time. Now, when it comes to your love life, there is, you know, there are times that you feel so stuck or that you will somehow miss the uh, presence of this other person. But that's very usual, you know, it's, and that's very common for those people who's been trying to move on from somebody. But you don't want to repeat that same mistake again, or you don't want to repeat that same um, betrayal, okay? You don't want to ruin whatever, the good things that's already um, in place right now. And you feel like you already found the right one, you, all, you already found the right place, so no need to ruin that again. And you are moving on from one phase to another, and you're growing. Now, you will have more time to have sex during this month. And I feel like, well, you're going to be staying at home more often. But I feel like this time, you know, for men, you're going to be focusing more on your enlargement and more development or, you know, how to increase your libido in your stamina and for women i feel like you're gonna be uh, wishing for something bigger okay now there are some manuals that you'll be reading and i feel like you're gonna be studying more angles and uh, more stuff and you're gonna be more into sex stories just to stimulate your you know your imagination and your fantasy which will be benefiting your uh, your relationship okay and um When it comes to your health, you need to, you need some vacation. You are, you know, right after all the efforts that you're going to be doing and putting on and all those energy, you need to have a little bit of a vacation, okay? Because you're going to get burned out. Immune system, you need to strengthen. Be careful with someone who is sick that will be passing on something to you. And you also need to detoxify, rejuvenate. Oh, and go for some facial, you know. You also need to pamper yourself. Um, there is something that you are eating that is not really healthy, but you feel like it is a medicine, okay? 
you need to stop doing this otherwise it's just gonna get worse and there will be some consequences that you don't want to have now uh you also need to concentrate to well it seems like you're gonna have some confusion and you're gonna have some problems with your concentration feeling a little bit more confused that even though there is a person or there is someone who's standing right in front of you talking you can see them talking but you can't really understand what they are you know what they are saying because you're going to be mentally blocked immune system that you need to strengthen the heartburn and digestive system digestive problems um breathing problems asthma and high blood pressure okay you need to do some exercise and go back to your usual work regime anyway Let's take a look at your singles forecast. Before we proceed to your um Okay, before we proceed to your uh, September forecast, okay? You know, even though the, you will have a lot of hard time adjusting to the new environment that you're in right now. Oh, well, good news. There is a new love life that's going to be coming your way. Wait, just a younger water sign as well. Now, you need to be very careful with the friends around you or someone who act like your friend. Because definitely this is, you know, the, there is someone around you who is just acting like a friend, but they are an enemy. Okay? um also be careful in signing new contracts or signing any bank guarantees or guaranteeing for somebody because it might just get you into trouble or long-term trouble or commitment that you don't want to now good news about your love life <clears throat> definitely there is someone that you'll be meeting which is a younger water sign okay that will be giving more meaning to your happiness and uh, even though you're gonna have a hard time adjusting to your new environment and adjusting to your new um new role responsibilities boss and colleagues you'll definitely be making it so you don't really have to worry about whether you're going to be making it to the probation period or you're going to be like staying here for good okay don't worry about getting fired they don't see you get um doing it and you will be very mo much more inspired by dating and knowing this younger water sign uh there will be a change of situation and there will be a, like a slight improvement which is you just need to be a little bit more practical and adapt whatever that needs to be taken and remove whatever that's not really needed for you to keep okay concentrate more on your finances because you will have more stable growth and more opportunity that's going to be knocking and coming your way down till the end of december all right let's take a look at your september forecast okay september forecast Wow. September will be very, very good for you. 
Mm. I feel like this is the start of your abundance. <clears throat> You know, a friend from work will be asking for your ID or input, but just make sure that the idea that you'll be giving this person is something that they cannot use against you or to take an opportunity away from you. Because as I've said, that there are some people around your work that will be acting like your friend, but the truth is they are your enemies, so they are frenemies. And there are a lot of people who's very envious of your progress, especially when you make that um, new purchase, new house purchase, or you're going to be going through a renovation. The, the, the car is not that big thing, you know, but it's the house. You know, the prosperity that you've been waiting for, it is definitely coming this month. As the first two weeks of the month will be very, very, very good. And for those who's waiting for the promotion, you will be granted. Yes, there will be a celebration that you have to know, that you have to heed. And this is the start of your new beginning and more financial stability. I also feel like your salary will be increasing four times. Ah, good for you. I feel like you will also be able to travel for pleasure by the end of this month. Okay? Now, you know, when it comes to sex, don't be such a pillow princess. You also need to exert a little bit more effort. Okay, now, okay, first two months, as I've said, that you would get so tied up with your responsibilities and with your newfound beginnings, with your promotion, there will be a celebration, people will be congratulating you, you're going to be more busy, you're going to be a boss, okay, or you're going to be starting your own business or launching your own business, which is you will be moving from one phase to another, even though there will be some discontentment that you're going to be feeling, but that is not really important at this time, you will be, you will know how to wait for the right time and for the right moment, and when the uh, opportunity is also right, and you're going to be growing even more smarter, um, you'll be gaining more wisdom out of this experience, and growing even more matured. Now, when it comes to your workplace, as I've said, be very careful who's going to be asking you for an idea or for an input about, you know, like an idea about a project. But just make sure that you're that they are not going to be using it against you or make sure that it's going to be to your advantage. OK, and that you will be credited for your opinion or for your advice, because this person who will be asking you for your, you know, solicited advice wants to have the role that you're in right now so what they're going to do is that they want to show the management that they also deserve to be promoted and to have what you have right now because they are smarter than you but unfortunately this person is only a copycat now you need to improve more of your obser observation skills your judgment and your communication skills okay but still glory will be yours and you're still going to be the winner. You'll, you'll, you will continuously reach the top. Now, uh, 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 uh. now this person, this fire sign person that you're with when it comes to your love life, which is a fire sign, will keep on bringing up the past. 
there will be some arguments, tensions, and uh, some scorning here and there. But then you don't want to put up with this kind of, you know, with this kind of um, drama anymore as you feel like you're done. Okay, you've already done your best and you've already com contributed whatever you feel like is needed to bring back this person into your life. And if they're not yet happy with whatever you can give them, then it's just time to really move on. Okay, but that is not going to happen because this person is just full of insecurities, fears, and bitterness. And you will understand that by the end of the month because you will be working on your communications and you will be working on your relationship and compatibilities. Sex life. Uh, I feel like you're going to be a little bit more adventurous that while you're cooking, you want to do it there. And you will also love a little bit of a role playing this month. Now, some Pisces will also have a hard time getting it up. As I've said, you need to, you know, work on your imagination. And if you, you know, there are some other methods that you can use and do, then do so. Now, when it comes to your health, I don't see any major problem when it comes to your health, except that you're going to be always daydreaming, preoccupied, slight headache, and your health will be improving. You just need to rehydrate. Be careful that walking in the dark or driving in the dark because you're going to be a little bit more blind spotted or you're going to have some, some spots, okay? And aside from that, I feel like you're going to be grooming yourself. You will also be going for some facial treatment because of the, uh, you know, the those things that's been growing in your skin. And you will continuously have skin asthma. Now, let's take a look at your singles forecast this month of September. You know, I just re-uploaded the, uh, the Aquarius video because um, while I'm starting out the playlist, um, it is checked. I was supposed to choose the, um, you know, cho to uh, put it in a playlist for 2019 advanced forecast, but then I accidentally pressed the delete, so I re-uploaded it. And, you know, it's not that I keep on uploading it over and over and over again. I know that I have uploaded it twice, but, uh, the, you know, I've had some issues with the music at the first um, upload, and then now, yeah. So let's take a look. Singles. And you know what? I really value your comments and your suggestions. You know, if I especially if I feel like your suggestion is really healthy and the, you know it will be improving more, why not? But for those who's been like demanding too much for a free reading, come on. You know, because I'm already trying my best to squeeze my time to deliver you the, um, you know, this forecast. And uh, I can't really fit all of your wishes, you know, or demands. And besides, this is a general reading. Anyway, single. Single Pisces, you are going to be a little bit hesitant. It's like you're going to be like drawing the sticks or you're going to be choosing which one is more beneficial for you or not. Now, you're not really getting along with your colleagues and you're having a hard time getting along with your boss as well. You just want to be happy and you just want something to work for you. But it seems like at this point you are full of struggle. You're having a hard time working on your, you know, working on your uh, new venture and new work or new responsibilities. And, bec and be because of this, you are starting to think of transferring to a new department or to a new company or taking a better new offer. Um, I feel like by the end of this month, you will be moving away or quitting. And there is another job that will be given to you or that will be offered to you. And this is the one that you're going to be taking. Um, you'll be giving them a 30 day notice about your resignation. And I feel like the next job that you'll be getting, which is, you know, a better paying job, but it's up to you if you're going to be staying. Oh, good. It seems like with an other job, you know, the new job opportunity that's going to be coming your way. It seems like you're going to be sticking around with this for a long period of time. Okay. Um, love life, 
I don't see anybody coming in. But it will be, you know, whoever you're gonna, whoever you're dating in the month of July, then it will still sorry in July and August, then it will be continuing this month of September. Okay, I don't see any changes, or I don't see any improvement of some sort. Let's take a look at your month of October. And now for the month of October, let's take a look. You know, the reason why it's, um, it's taking so much time for me to upload all the videos is because the editing and the um, conversion, it takes 10 hours. And then when there are some things like, for example, a part that has no sound or the video just to uh, freeze or it's just pure black that i have to redo it you know and then the snipping the cutting reapplying insertion it takes some time so yeah this is just a temporary thing anyway Month of October, you're going to be on the go. You're very inspired, creative, mm. fast. Which is good. You're moving. There will be a big transition that's also going to be happening to you. Okay, let's shuffle again. The month of October for you will be very, very good financially. Okay. I can see you bagging a huge amount of money. Okay. Hmm. You will be traveling along with an older fire sign during this time, and I feel like there will be some negotiations, and there will also be some family stuff that you have to face. If you also have a father that's a fire sign, then I feel like this is more of a family visit that you're going to be making this trip. Okay. Financially, I feel like you are going to be doing well. Okay, there are also some old clients, old transactions, um, agreements, contracts that will also be coming back to you and they would want your business or your service again. Okay, especially if you're into sales, then this is going to be a very, very profitable month for you. Now, for those who's actually in the field of media, you will be very inspired okay to do your creative art your creative media or create creative piece and i feel like this is also the time where you will be creating a lot of your ideas
okay you're molding them into something that's you know that could drive you to you know a lot of revenues or if you were into music making comp uh, composition or into entertainment then this is also the perfect time for you to rise to stardom okay there will be some offers that you have to consider and that you have to look into the contract before signing it all right plus you will be introducing somebody very special to your family and i feel like for those who's already married there will be some family um it's a family forgiveness, a family reunion, or you're going to be like, um, but try to get close to your family and ask for some forgiveness or, you know, some harmony that will be restored. But still, you need to protect yourself and you need to protect your own self-interest and security. Now, when it comes to your work, as I've said that you're going to be a little bit, um, you know, inspired. You're on the go. You're going to be in demand. You're also going to be very generous. And money is not going to be a problem for you, okay? This is where you can simply relax and, and pamper yourself and, you know, um, improve yeah, the interior of your house, change uh, some, some furniture, or if you want to get a new car, then yes, this is the perfect timing for that, okay? There's also some um, outdoor repairs that you need to do in your, you know, in your place or in your house. This is the perfect time for you to find the, you know, a better contractor that will give you a better price. When it comes to your, hmm, when it comes to your, oh, by the way, some Pisces will also be receiving an award during this time. So congratulations to you. Now, when it comes to your, um, to your love life. This air sign that you're still trying to cut off from your from your life, okay? It seems like you need to work harder into cutting off this person permanently because it seems like this person just feels like you're only playing games, okay? Well, it's not that you're playing games, but I feel like they just don't really get it, okay? Because they're still hoping and they are still clinging on to that last hope that you might change your mind you might have a change of feelings or change of heart and you're gonna go back to them choose them over and over again you know stuff like that but then you're you've already made up your mind okay you're gonna be sticking around with a fire sign and you're gonna be um thinking more about your future and in fact either you're gonna be buying a house you're gonna be improving your house or you're gonna be moving into a new location or a new house altogether okay sex life it's gonna be it's gonna it's gonna get a little bit more wild during this month and i feel like you are gonna be very happy you'll go you're going for some second honeymoon for those who's already married and there's also a possibility for those who wants to have a baby this is the perfect time for it because you're gonna be very fertile and it, you're gonna have some healthy you know some healthy thing for you to create a baby and both of you will be very very in the mood and you're gonna be more into oral now painful menstruation for those uh, single Pisces and I feel like you're gonna have some problems with your breathing which is asthma or bronchial asthma due to an allergy and you also need to it looks like you need to flush some of your toxins inside your body so that you'll feel a little bit more lighter and great and you also need to flush down your fats that's been growing and some of the pisces either they're going to find out that they are pregnant during this month or they're about to deliver or they just simply want to have a baby okay and this as i've said this is the perfect time for you to to to, to make one because you're going to be very fertile going organic and stick around with your healthy diet go natural um I also feel like you need to stop smoking if you want to save more of your um if you want to save more of your lungs of your you know for your for your throat and for your nasal problems especially those who's singing or especially those who's in the field of entertainment you will also be very sensitive to lights you know when you're driving at night or when you're outside in the evening and you need to rehydrate plus you need to regain your balance okay because somehow you're gonna have some problems with your you know blockages or you're gonna be feeling a little bit mental blocked for those who is and at the age of 40s to 60s varicose veins or problems with your veins okay 
plus arthritis or rheumatism. Let's take a look, singles, what's going to be coming your way. All right. Be careful in dating someone who's already married, okay? Especially if you don't really know this person too much or if you're working with this person and you already know their reputation because I feel like this person will only be using you. That There will be some confrontations either from the, you know, from the, their partner or you're going to be confronting them that they did not tell you that, you that they are already married, okay? Be careful in playing the victim because I don't really see it going anywhere. Even though this person will be making you physically happy and satisfied. Because that's the one that you're going to be craving. And then they're going to be putting up some dramas or some sorry stories for you to feel, you know, compassionate. And for you to feel sorry for them or, you know, sympathize into their situation. Just because that, you know, they're going through some hardships and stuff but it's not really the first time that they have done this they just want to get to you and they just want to win okay um meanwhile if you can wait there is another person that's going to be coming your way that is even more worthy of your time and energy and you know everything else that you can invest in a relationship this is your perfect um match and uh you know your equal half uh, i feel like this is a fire sign more likely in Aries. So, if you can wait, much better for you to go for the single one rather than dating the uh, the married one because you're going to be missing out a lot of, you know, happy moments and real emotions rather than being used physically. Even though this person can really, you know, drive you insane in bed, but so what, you know? Anyway, um, there is a brand new company position or job that will be open and you want to try it and you want to apply for it even though there is a contract that will be binding you to your current uh, job right now or to your current um you know i mean in this month of october even though there will be some contracts that will be binding you to your current company you will find a way okay on how to get out of it but still there will be a very attractive um offer that you're going to be taking advantage plus you are going to receive a bonus so let's take a look at your month of november Oh. Oh wow. So the last quarter of the year for you will be very, very good. Which is starting September. Hmm.
You will also be organizing an event during this month for your company or for your team. And I feel like this will be more of an additional bonus for your leadership thing. Performance. Mm. Bit of a drama. Be careful in being blackmailed for single Pisces during this month, okay? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You are going to be missing somebody that's more of a third wheel. And I feel like there is something that will be happening between the two of you, like a very hot intimacy. Careful, careful, careful. It's definitely you're gonna be catch red handed. Your partner will catch you. You need to be very careful about that. And your partner is very intuitive. Even though most of the times you always um Okay. All right, month of November, good news flying your way, and uh, there will be different correspondences here and there. Most of your intuition or most of the things that you have already predicted right from the very beginning of this year will finally be coming true. The money that you're expecting, it is finally going to be wrapped up and will be handed over to you. Okay, you will also be holding a high position. Either you're going to be starting your own business, you've started your own business, or you're going to be promoted in a higher position than what you, you previously had or handled, you know, in the past year. There's also some bank information, bank loans or bank transactions or legal stuff that you have to go through in a contract that you need to sign. Things will slowly change and will be uplifting and you're going to be concentrating more on your work and you're going to be very inspired okay to deliver and to have a better life and to give a brighter future for your you know for those who's about to get married or for those who's already married and you will be attending a lot of meetings so you're going to be very preoccupied and very busy during this month i feel like you're going to be missing out the uh well not really missing out but you're going to be attending your corporate um, thanksgiving dinner rather than going straight to your home dinner and, or attending to your family your friends now work wise you are going to be invited you're going to be invited in um like in, in an event or training or conference or seminar to be a speaker and you're going to you're going to be inspiring a lot of people okay um you will also be picturing yourself to be somebody else or to it's like you want to cre recreate yourself or you want to procreate yourself to become somebody that you really envisioned yourself to be years from now okay and you will be putting more your focus on your work and improvement even though there are some discontentment that will be happening or that you will be going through you're just going to set it aside and try to be content and try to you know, meditate and to manifest the things that you really want. And then there will be some rising and um, a death and rebirth, okay? Meaning that, of course, you're going to be changing your position and you're going to be sitting in a higher position. So that is going to be more likely the death and rebirth. And aside from that, you're going to be traveling to a bigger city during this end of the month of November. Love life. Bit of a trouble and drama. Um, 
instead of cutting off this person who's been continuously seducing you, you are going to be paying attention to them and you're going to be like um, giving them an importance. That's why you will somehow feel so stuck that, you know, instead of moving away from the temptation, you are walking through it. Um, you will fail to protect your circle or your relationship during this point. And there is a possibility of being intimate again with this person this month. Okay. Both of you will be very busy with the preparation for those who's about to get married. Okay. Those, both of you will be very busy with the preparation. And for some who is already married, you're going to be very busy with your booming job and um profession so both of you will be upscaling and uh, increasing your leverage so this is the one that will be dividing both of you but you will be you know continuously working on your relationship but there will be some third party okay either from your side or from your partner's side now when it comes to your health don't stay too late at night you will also have some problems with your eyes you will notice that your other eye is not really following the other. So more likely a lazy eye. Okay. And then you have to go and approach the doctor to see if there's any vein that's being clipped or that's being, you know, um, it's being affected. Be careful with parasites or eating that is not really healthy or something that is not yet washed or hygienic or not really hygienic. Or like, let's say, for example, some street food. And... You will also be very sensitive to light, sensitive to smell, and sensitive to the noises that you will hear outside or to other people. There is also a phobia that will be developing into you, which you will somehow feel weird about it at first, but then you will be making a research and you'll feel that it is normal or that it is part of the human existence. Uh, you also need to rehydrate and um, detoxify. Your immune system and then heartburn heart problems and high blood pressure you also need to sleep more plus you are not really wasting your time not to have sex because you're gonna be very very you know for women you're gonna be very fertile and for men you're gonna be so into it okay you're going to have a lot of energy. Of uh, energy. Okay, singles, let's take a look at your month of November. The devil, king of coins, seven of swords, four of swords, page of cups, seven of coins. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, number one is that there is someone who is doing something to you when it comes to your work. Number two, don't mess around with your boss at work. Okay, because you're going to get in, or get entangled into a very big scandal or like an embarrassment or an unhealthy relationship that you don't really want to be a part of it in the first place. Now, your health will also be not so healthy and not so strong. So be very careful and take the, uh, you know, enough vitamins or enough medications for you, for you to strengthen your immune system. I also feel like you're still going to be wallowing whatever that's failed, but then you just need to look into the brighter side of life. And there is an unexpected money coming your way, okay? Um, there is going to be a very, hmm, well, there's like a new business that you're going to be trying to work on, or there's an existing business that you will have an additional capital, or you're going to be loaning for a new capital for your business, okay? You're going to be granted for it. Love life, 
you're still gonna be very unhappy. Um, you're gonna be questioning a lot about your relationships, okay? And I feel like there will be an answer that you're gonna be coming up with because it seems like your partner isn't really telling you something that you're supposed to know, and there will be a big revelation that will be surprising you right by the end of this month. All right, let's take a look finally at your month of December. My right eye is really itchy. I don't know why. Ooh. Looks like this ear sun is going to be winning over you. And the fire sun will be packing all their stuff and like, you know, they're going to go. So there will be a tug of war. They are going to be like uh, pulling for each other. Or literally, you're going to be pulling them inside your place or inside your house and trying to stop them from leaving. I know you should have been, you know, a little bit stronger than that. All right, month of December, something that you've been waiting for to happen will finally be coming into light and the money will also be coming to you as well. So more money to come, but you will be feeling a little bit reserved and a little bit stoic and uh, um, well reserved and quiet and uh, it's like you don't want anybody else to know about your secret, okay? Changes around your road. Uh, your residence, you'll be moving into a new place or someone will be moving out of your house. Uh, more communications and correspondence says you're gonna be you're gonna get caught up with your work between your family and your work and um, 
I feel like you're going to be taking a break on the last week, which will be around the holidays, the last week of this month, and you just want to have a little breather, okay? I just you deserve it anyway. Now, when it comes to your work, you are going to be like uh, starting a leadership module or training, but just be very careful because someone might just copy your idea and they might implement the same, and you're the one who might end up looking like um, the copycat and the... Uh, they will just claim the uh you know the, the right for it so there will be some agonies right before you go for our holidays but you will be getting the right help back up and influence okay be feeling a little bit generous and you will also be helping out some of your old work colleagues and um you're gonna be a little bit more giving and you're gonna be giving way for someone who is older than you but hasn't you know experienced being promoted yet Feeling the winner or being the winner because there is a, an award or recognition or it could be that in the month of November you're going to be like um, a candidate for that and then you're going to be getting the award during this month. But whatever it is, you are still going to be the winner, okay? Now, when it comes to your love life, it seems like this air sign is going to be winning over you. And instead of you walking away or moving away, this fire sign will be catching you, as I've said, you know? that you have to be careful because your partner will be catching you red-handedly and this this fire sign will be packing their stuff and leave because this is the last time that they're going to be giving you your last chance but you're going to be blowing it so there will be some altercations that's going to happen right around before the holidays or christmas but it will get sorted out because someone from your family members will be mediating between the two of you now you need to use some protection if you're having sex with someone that you're not in partners with because definitely there is an accident that might happen and you might have a um, you know a child outside of your relationship or marriage and you need to stop sneaking around okay and I feel like when well, you know you and your partner are just both wearing masks and not really being true to yourselves you don't satisfy each other and you just need to be open and honest about it instead of pretending you know and faking those moans and uh, at the end of the day you would just keep on thinking about someone else because you can't really find the right satisfaction that you want from your partner okay now and this is also the reason why you're going to be going for the other temptation because you are looking for something wild and spontaneous rather than being conservative and always in a missionary compromising position. Now, when it comes to your health, the only thing that's left is that your immune system that you just need to keep on boosting, skin problems... Being so conscious of your exterior features and your, or your, or your, sorry, or your outer beauty. And you need to turn your back on a particular food lifestyle or eating habit. But let's say, for example, skipping meals. And you also need to offer something natural. You also need to take care of your teeth because you're going to have frequent bone or, you know, toothache okay or bone problems and aside from that you need to be able to, you need to have more concentration because you're going to be feeling still mental blocked and a little bit preoccupied okay okay and you're going to be distracted a little bit you're going to be crafting some things that is not related to your work it's more of a side interest that you really wanted to do but you just can Really find the right opportunity to make it as money or to make it as a side business but then you will try okay all right December hopefully it's in and you know the cards will show you something good and something better going through a transitional phase by going through a heartbreak you will be traveling 
a fire sign from your a fire sign from the past which you used to be with Oh, it seems like things needs to get worse before it gets better. And this person who broke your heart will be proposing to you. There are a lot of things that you need to consider right before saying yes to this person, especially if you're not been very happy and contented. And there's this person just keeps on, you know, uh, philandering or womanizing. So... There are a lot of things that you need to consider, but both of you have, you know, same feelings for each other, and both of you are still expecting that there will still be more from this, like, for example, marriage. Um, I don't feel like you're ready for, you know, for the bigger commitment or for or to have a family, but then this person wants to have more from you, so you need to be very clear with your, you know, with your intentions towards each other and what do you really expect out of this relationship. Now, when it comes to your, when it comes to your um, love life, it seems like, I uh, sorry, your work life. It seems like your love life is the one that's been affecting you along with your performances and your promotion or getting the right type of um, opportunity, okay? Oh, the good thing here is you're going to be settling down and I feel like you are going to be very happy, okay? Um... I feel like you would just decide to start your own business or invest into something that you feel like it can start from something small or some or just a scratch, but you will eventually grow it into something bigger with the right connection and with the right network and with the right backbone. Okay. Money will also be coming in from it's more of a relative, more likely an inheritance. An unexpected money that will be given to you, okay? And that you will also be receiving. Let's take a look finally at your Oracle cards. Hmm, okay, now I need to work on the uh, Virgo, Libra, and Leo. Okay, practical intuition, clarity, go with the flow, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. All right, now... You need to practice your practical intuition during the month of January if there is any essential decision or any essential situation or person that you need to analyze and observe, okay? February, you're gonna be, you're, you will be gaining some clarity about where you should go, what you should do, and what to do in a particular relationship or person. Go with the flow, stop um, controlling, and you also need to stop being too dominating over others okay sometimes you just need to learn how to go with the flow and to respect other people's boundaries which is speaking of in the month of april this is going to be what you have to learn boundaries and set some boundaries from other people who will be crossing the line especially for those who will be acting like a friend but in fact they are only frenemies now the month of may clear aura you will be changing your appearance and you will be changing your aura month of june freedom for those who will be letting go of their um, anxiety problems and unhealthy connections relationships and toxicity you will be choosing freedom the month of july responsibility you will be growing more matured and owning up to owning up to your own mistakes and month of august transformation month of september giving you the strength to withstand the situation september sorry october joy you know because you're um starting from the month of september onwards the last quarter of the year for you will be very very beneficial and good rather than the um 
this one the first few months so october joy and november inspiration and you will also have you know more strength and creativity in you and more discoveries about who you really are as a person and what you can do and then december is divine love finding whatever that is rightfully meant for you and meeting your fate and destiny all right so finally if you want to have your own personal um, annual forecast, just go and visit me at my website. My website is currently going through a lot of uh, developments and construction. Okay, Live video call is not available for now because we are creating a new platform. Okay, So I'll just make more announcements. All right. So have a great 2019. And you may talk to me live on the phone. Or, you know, you can offer a pre-recorded video readings. All right. Blessings to you. And now you may watch my YouTube videos inside the app of Daily Horoscope by Cheetah Mobile. You know, the good thing about this app is that it's not just all about horoscope. Okay. You may also ask your burning question, especially if you can't wait for a psychic to talk to. And this is a very quick and concise, in-depth explanation that will just give you all the information that you really need to know about your love life, your money and finances, plus your health. And right after browsing all the meetings, you know, choosing all the cards... You may go and browse for more, like the advanced forecast for tomorrow, weekly, monthly, and yearly. Now, there are also some other areas in this app that you may find very useful and informative, like their relationship articles and other, you know, um, things about the zodiac signs. And if you're also dating, go and check out your match with their featured tab. And choose your sign and then the sign of the person that you're dating plus their personalities, you know, make it work, last long, and, you know, or it's is it just much better to cut it off. You may also check out their Chinese signs and don't forget to get their birth, their birth year as well, all right, for more compatibilities. So, for more information, check out the description box below. It's available in Google Play and Apple Play Store.